Hi, Miss Marion. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Hello. I'm good. Hey, I'm going to pause the recording for a few minutes and we'll see who else logs in. We'll give them about. Huh? They made it. <laughs> they, they made That's a awesome. kill and they, they're fixing the. I got this meeting is being recorded in that little sign and then my technician already left. Oh, it's fine. It'll go away on its own. I just oh, okay. uh, had to press record because I almost forgot. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, Grandma Dorothy, uh, the spring break for Anna Darko is March uh, 13th to 17th. It'll be next so, week. Oh, we got one. Yeah. Week. I, figured, yeah. I, never kid, yeah, I don't have anyone in school, you know, just <laughs> great grandkids. Yeah. Well, that's cool. I know that's that's when uh, the Kiowa tribe is having, uh, aren't they having like a spring break camp thing, a culture camp or something? I think next weekend I'm supposed to go with, uh, what's her name? I th she's going to drive me that, Darlene. Thank you. Oh, cool. Oh, good. Um, she said in the afternoon, you know, so I won't stay there, but about an hour or two, about two hours. Uh, it's uh, up at That's the good. AOA, I guess. What does AOA uh -huh. mean? What does AOA mean? Uh, I think it's Administration on Aging. It's a uh, okay. federal funding. <laughs> uh, uh, when David Gibbons yeah. had it. My sister Anna Sue and I used to be able to go to a lot of their trips and they were fun, you know, like I was yeah. just thinking that's when I got put out when we were playing at uh it was Santa Darko because it was um Beatty Girls. Oh and yeah. We got put out of the building. <laughs> oh no. But I'm a bad fan, so <laughs> oh gosh the dean of the whole school came out and apologized wow robin, robin kinkenberg came out from nowhere and she was irate you know because uh i paid for my ticket and then they yeah. come before the game started and said ladies go on the other side this is for the team we were playing Oh. And I, I said, I'm handicapped and it's closer to the bathroom for me. Uh -huh. I don't want to move. And they said, I had to move. Oh. <laughs> it wasn't That's even crazy. Then as soon as the game started, one of them made a war hoop. And, oh. then, it was, and then it was on. <laughs> oh, no. That's crazy. So I don't, I, I don't talk about it when I talk about basketball games. I said, I've been putting it put out of the best places. Throw down at Clinton, too, with the whole school at Riverside. Oh, I mean, my the whole, gosh. They escorted every bus out of there. Us. Wow. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> they were all connecting yep. all from already in. One of our boys from Riverside, they, they're... Mascot was a little lion or some. He tied his tail to one of the poles in there. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> to me it was funny, you know. We didn't get involved, but we got escorted out of there. Wow. That's crazy. <laughs> I 
I'm a bad Lots fan. Of <laughs> Lots of excitement. Um, so let's see here uh, to get us started. Um, why don't we, uh, let's see. Um, Go ahead. Are it just you and I right now? It's me, you, and then we have Miss Marion and Courtney on with us. Okay. I just think that I was talking too much. Oh, you're fine. Um, I did get a message from uh, Aunt Carolyn and Grandma Dorothy, and they said they are driving back from Rainy Mountain, so they are not able to make it. And then Kathy messaged and said she's not able to make it either. So we'll just, you know, do what we can do. Um, so I guess my uh, question is, do we want to continue trying to translate the Kiowa Proverbs recordings? I think we got through the first one and I'll go ahead and play it again here in a minute. Um, but I just wanted to, you know, see what you thought. Or if you want to listen to a different recording. Anything y'all want, I'm just listening. Where's Velma Ruth and all of them? Um, they're not here yet. They usually get on uh, about 3.30 is when they get on. But um, yeah, it's just us so far. Um, okay, so for our opening prayer, um, Miss Marion, if you're able to, Bay Dots, I... Thank God. Oh. あ、ほれ、ドキ。え、ไอ้ก็ทุ่มไอ้ก็ทุ่มก็เก็บดอกไอ้เต๋อเด็กก็ไอ้ก็เก็บไอ้เต๋อก็ไอ้ก็เก็บไอ้เต๋อก็ไอ
Amen. 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 Awesome. Um, okay, so let's see. I'm checking to see who else. Um, all right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play uh, the recording that we transcribed so far and see uh, what you think of it. And then we'll go into, uh, um, I think we were working on the second speaker, which was James Silverhorn. And we only got maybe like not very far into it. So we'll see if we can make some sense of his speech there. So, all right, let me share my screen. And this is a uh, Kiowa culture program number uh, 241. And let's see. With. Okay, tell me when you can see my screen. I can see it. All right, awesome. Okay, let me, uh, I'm gonna stop my video because sometimes my internet uh, messes up with the video and the sound. So I'm gonna stop video, but I'm going to, uh, let's see, go to five minutes. I think it's five minutes and 11 seconds. This is when uh, Louis Toibo starts. So we can uh, follow along with what we have so far. Okay. Ah, uh, uh, go. On e. Okay, wait. Can you hear that? Is that too low? Huh. You hear? It? Okay. Go. Uh, go. Don't get get out. Don't get out. Don't get out. Don't on a hold out of Don't Call Tonka Oka Eto Gat Oh, I get on eat a tonki on get oi got a call. I don't oh, I got the key. Ain't it so bad? Don't get on. Son, don't talk. Don't talk. Don't talk. Don't I got eager, higher, hunter, hold, don't get a content of order. The man does on it, auto. Don't aim, I got all your cup, all your ticket again, but I go. I'm a more count. Oh, yo, and oak, yeah, yo, day.
Okay. So that was uh, his speech. And then let me scroll down. I have to still uh, put the uh, modified McKinsey in there. Um, so the next speaker, and this is what we were working on last time, uh, is James Silverhorn. And so he talks really fast. And so it's really hard to kind of make out some of what he's saying, but this is as far as we got. So I'll go ahead and play it and see if we want to start there. Ah, <laughs> On the M. Goot, no tender, who young gained the sun, the way on the gate, thought on a key. On the air to get out on a puyan bat, oh, come, grand day. We goot that I got don't get so get up, but keep a gig or get out at them, pan, pan em, cook all them, keep. Pan gould, I got pay pan gould, I think I had it. Talia, tado them could chop, pick it out them. Pan Gould, get Oama, Pine, got Oa, get Oama, all corn of Oyo Gao Hinta, say on their key, on the garment. Pay up or don't they get gone, will be that I can know. They are the key, no anchor, dog, you go for the lank, they keep a tongue and auntie, cause up, they get a god, I can know, and keep come on. On the so get got, can a con, could do good, not the gang of sand, that dog, you could get. Come in, don't but hike of a bow, can't it suck up at it? No, be it, I don't want to shunt or it's a long time to say, and I want to go with all them, cut to them, shun it to cool. Don't get so loud, get on out the key, get out the car, and cut all children, they can't take it, toss out the key, I got a cock, a yonk. Ten, though, that's a mono, can't take a man more, a pound take up, oh, yeah, that's a demal. Kema haiki dokka, eli kopa lonta ei kettä noiko biinte dokki ko ei oike te guute, että ne ha ei teiltä ei tom dokka lonta ei te soke teiltä vaan monko on eli ko akana saante vuokka. Näin kun noita te agiita. Aleita. 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 Before we go into the line by line, um, Grandma Dorothy, did you want to make any comments on things that stood out to you? Well, he well, does he talk does good. Talk. He does talk fast, but it's you can understand if you you're going. He's he's a little bit miffed because the younger generation at that time would not listen. And good don't know, means that he's given them advice and they still uh, are not interested. So the key I got, and it could it could have been us in that in that period of time. I was already a grown woman when they were doing this back in the seventies, but mm -hmm. it could have been very well, you know, us in our our you know time. But he says, they just do not listen. And the ones that really knew and cared, he's saying that too. They're all gone. They go hang it up. And I like the way he said, I'm going to touch on this word for a little while. I like that sentence. And he said, yeah, don't ye dope. When he's going to yeah. talk about something. I'm going to touch on this with my talk for a little while. And then it's just about the younger ones, just uh, at that time, just seem. And of course, at that time, this was that was our only speech program. We were just starting, you know. Uh -huh. And so he has a point there, you know. The people didn't have all we have now to have these different teachers and everything. And yeah, that was Mr. Silverhorn. He was. He was uh, good to listen to. 
And then the one before that was, uh, I think it was Mr. Toybo. Oh. But he was saying, uh, just be quiet and listen. You know, <laughs> and it, I heard that. So it's really true. It's sometimes you can't wait to give your opinion. It's a bad habit. But yeah, it's really, uh, I, I got a new word I can use, get don't ye, data. Or get you don't ye don't. And <laughs> I understood every word he said, but as to writing it as he's talking, it's impossible. He talks to he's it's so fluent. Oh, but you can touch on it real easy. It's good good talk. Uh -huh. Oh, uh -huh. uh -huh, Grandma. Um, Miss Marion, uh -huh. would you like to uh -huh. comment? Um, well, on Louis first, I was just going to ask Dorothy, he said at the very end, I don't know, I can't hear all day. Did you hear that? Um, I can't hear all day. Dorothy? Dorothy? Bye. <laughs> Louis Toivo said, and his last uh, word was, um, I can't hear all day. When Louis I, was talking, his last. He was calling somebody. That was, I never heard that word. I mean, sentence. I knew what it, what it means, or I don't know what it means. I, I know what he's saying, but I don't know the explanation yeah. for that. That sounds like yeah, you have yeah, some just... or cuss with the human oh. race if you're all day, or is does he mean uh, uh, can he one man you're all day? I don't know. Because he tells people that tells them not to be to pay attention. Don't be speak, don't be interrupting when someone is speaking. You speak afterwards. <clears throat> He's talking about when the elders are coming. They says don't forget in in parts of it. I mean, um, I, I, I I never I never heard that expression. Mm -hmm. I've heard all that's day fine. maton, that's, all day maton, and all day tali, and I've never heard kahi all day. I think that's because they just don't sort of grow up. <laughs> And I'm sure coming from him, it I must guess. be graceful. I really don't. You know, but, well, that's why I wanted to get your version of it, because to me, it kind of meant that some, they're just not respectful, or they just we haven't seen the suck in their heads to be that way respectful. And so they like, he said, um, I can't heal. But anyway, okay. But uh, with, yeah, I agree with what Dorothy was saying about um, uh, Silverhorn, his comments. But of course, he's uh, saying there should be respect and same thing and just giving little uh, tips, not tips, but, uh, you know, talking about just so many different things. Um, Related to being, you know, respectful and knowing, touching on the behavior of the children that uh, we're forgetting, even at that time, much of the information. And um, now I lost my train of thought. <laughs> He's uh, talking about how the elders were knew so much, and um, of course nowadays no, everything. I'll just stop there. <laughs> everything, every statement we because make is a correction. Uh huh. And so, even at that time, I noticed I was, I was a younger person, of course, at that time. 
even yeah. before they were doing this and I spoke I to would, some I of the people that were dared. were these ages or a little bit older. They they had no idea about some of these. I would these, not have uh, dared to tell the elders to to uh, learn how to uh, respect people. I wouldn't have dared. Uh, but nowadays it's it's but, free speech. Uh, I wanted to find out. Mm -hmm. I'll give you an instance. Uh, I wanted to find out because I found some papers where it was telling what Chicago's were in their 90s, who were, there was a group that were in their 80s and their birthdays and stuff like that. Now they say they can't do that because it's a freedom of, I mean, whatever, you're not supposed to give out information. Okay. Oh, it would have been good to send them a Christmas, a birthday card, each one when they turned a, a different age. But now they won't give it out, I don't think. That doesn't make any sense. These are our own people. I don't see why not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't care who knows how old I am. I look it. I oh, hope that was interesting. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was good. I liked it. I like. I enjoy it. You because might say so many words for that. Go ahead. Oh. Um. So I wonder if uh, it'd be nice to translate uh James Silverhorn, but I know he talks so fast. I feel like that'll just take like some more time, but. The next speaker, I think, is either Isabel Two Hatchet or Hazel Botone. And I know those they're more, uh, they speak a little bit more um, clear. So it might be easier to hear them. What do you think? Isabel was my lady. I like to hear her. <laughs> well, I can, I can press play again and we can listen to, uh, to the next speaker and then maybe rewind it and see if we can translate her instead. Mm. Okay, let me pull up the recording. Oops, let's see, did I press the right, make sure I press the right button here. Okay, make sure I'm sharing my sound. Okay, uh, cool. here's the, this is the uh, third speaker. And so we're at 10 minutes in, okay. Can you hear that? Yeah, I can. Yeah. Okay. Dopo do the tongue get on there, but all don't it get on the higher. Get come that go get I get all the. Don't it do go no back here. The. No, I love my own day. Ego, my daughter, okay, dear. Don't turn, son. I'm going to turn my boy, kiddie, and Tom Kid on them, daughter. Don't get it, and I get it. No, I'm a kiddie on them, Tom Kid on it. God, don't get it. Don't argue, get the air the key, go on, you get the on the air. And go, can you get those on my lips? So I get corn high, get the air on the a good tom key to elegant and all hard or sat down a day more come go. And go, can't come, go out there, the key, cook, pay, go get more time, don't know, get caught it, dog, go and go, cook more time, get it. I can't go high by oot or by shandy. No, I like to get high, get them go yakum da mod or them cot. Have a higher. No, I'll put a cook on boy dog cot a tom key to. By he tongue go get bored there, they got them cold with cook down him to. No, no, it ought to have the old tongue on. Ogon de do tonto to de 
Ogolal, he come on and em bone, we come on em oh he top. Ogon dan tozani, to the aid, 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 Go away, the more it's Sunday at Oki, go eight bail by the Toki, go bow, all go cack on the get door the gate, good the pie, the dog on the door take the chico. So get a cack on the atom, empty pie, good the toko, you don't get to avoid the key, the ammon, a poem, tom key, toy go be toby do the nigga, he go tie a coat. Don't boom, go go look on the toddy. Get dot or a horn and on tight get cold, you go on the cordel, donkey toddy. Oh, go, they say, but they go on tape a coy, they talk, or they go goop it or bram. Before your mom do talk when I yeah, Yantozan go talk, did they go, or you did get I. The solo, or you did not so I don't have. Advice, suggestion. A good soul on there, and don't get all good away of the key. So, yet they have a youth of a at all dog, go more good, get good the door. This one go a good bag again, and hide it outside all Oh, you did. Don't argue, get dog. Go do more going. I call my up a dog. Eat a on there, yeah. Em good thoughts. I'll get oily. Ego my up a cool go. Ego I get your don't get cold. Get hot. No, ye ain't do what dog. Okay. Uh, uh, did uh, first off, who was that? Did you recognize her? That was Hazel. 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 Hazel Bolton. Okay. Oh, okay. Um, okay. Uh, Grandma Dorothy, do you want to start with your comments first? I mean, she said, "Corn, hey, get high, get though," and that was a word used to be. Used quite a bit, corn. Hey, I know a little bit, Kiowa. You know, it's what it means. And I figured that we speak it good enough. She said that people should, however little we know, should respect that. And she said, and I heard another word I haven't heard. Don't I go? It's when you're arguing with somebody. Mm -hmm. That's a word fight. And nowadays, I guess we would call it uh, uh, disagreeing. <laughs> but Kaiwa said, mm -hmm. no, don't fight. I go. They're fighting with words. You know, there's a softer mm -hmm. way to say it now. But that, that sentence always tickled me when you say, I'm don't fight. All righty. Love you. Okay. Can you repeat that, Grandma Dorothy? Uh, don't, did you say don't tie got or don't? I gotta do clean it with bleach. All right, bye. Don't I, don't, what's on? Don't I go. It's don't a word. Don't I go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I've had a lot of that in my, oh, my lifetime, I'm getting fussed at by <laughs> older people when I was younger. And oh. it was always. When you talk too much. Is it, do you say that means fighting with words? Yes, it's what it says. Don't yes. words. I go is fighting. Don't I go. Uh -oh. Yeah, they had, they had no mm -hmm. way to uh, translate that. Oh. And I said, a lady that I was afraid of in Anadarko at one of the stores because she didn't want you to look at the books or anything. As soon as she went in, she started watching you. This was 50 years ago. 
That's the only one I ever says, Meg. It was from the candy kitchen. <laughs> They'll be. Oh. That's a lot of They sure do fight with words. I don't, don't buy the hop. I'm trying to take notes too. Oh, okay. I guess you would say sassy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll write that down. Hey, Dorothy, that candy kitchen woman was kind of strict and mean, wasn't she? What's she, that? I said that candy kitchen woman, she was kind of mean and strict, wasn't she? <laughs> yeah. Like she's gonna she's kind of Puritan looking or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they were the Watsons, during they were on the <laughs> <laughs> they had nickel, uh, they had, they didn't want you to sit down and read the funny books free. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> it, was the, it was the first Mom with Sabrina. <laughs> One played in my grandma or so my mom. I was really scared of her. Man. Betsy. Betsy was her name. Betsy. Betsy Walker. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's funny. Um, Miss Marion, do you want to make comments next? It's just uh, it's about talking about respect and um, talking about, um, you know, it's almost mentioned the same thing that uh, Silverhorn said. He just said, the men were talking, and that's what we're talking. That's what uh, they were, what they said was true. And then she said, uh, show respect. And she had some, some people don't have book learning, but she talked about her. Some people do, and she talked about the teachers, uh, where they say, show respect. And that it was um, when someone is talking, you know, same thing that Silverhorn said, it just, uh, um, Show the respect when someone is speaking. Have respect, and and she says. Uh, also, when you're oh, I go. She said it's like an arrow that goes out and it comes back to you. So you have to be careful with your words, and when you speak in anger. She says, "Ma, zay, zay, my yeah, oi, son, oh." Which means those sharp words, kind of like an arrow, you can turn around and come back. And uh, and then she said one word, Dorothy, ma gooey me, ma gooey me, ma gooey me, yeah. Said what? Ma gooey me. Really useful. Mm -hmm. you, you do useful things. Mm -hmm. Isn't that what it means? Yeah. yeah. Valuable. Learning is a good thing. And some will listen and they will take those words that she said at the very end. But to me, she meant like they'll take it as a learning a situation that they'll keep in their brains or head. But others will get up and walk out when you're trying to correct them or give them adv advice. Right. And uh, that's that's what I um, that's what I get from that. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> there, well, but you had so many good words in there. Oh, uh, it's just my awesome. summary. Appreciate that. Oh. Um, so let's see. 
Um, we had a, a couple others join. You heard Grandma Martha Nell on, and then uh, Alice Ann also joined us. So, um, so question, do we want to listen? Do we want to try to translate Hazel Botone's speech, or do you want to listen to the next speaker? Who's the next speaker? <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, let me see if I have it in my notes. I uh, don't remember. I can press play. We can listen to the next one. Is this Dale 241? Yeah. Okay, oh. Proverbs, Proverbs, okay. Oh. We were trying to decide if uh, we should try to translate. Uh, we kind of uh, put uh, James Silverhorn translation on hold. Okay, so we can hear. Uh, <laughs> it's really fast. <laughs> um, it's going to take a little bit, but uh, we were th thinking about maybe listening to um, translating this. Uh, the third speaker, which um, is Hazel Botone, the one we just listened to. Um, or we can listen to the next speaker. Mm -hmm. um, okay, I wrote down the timestamps for Hazel Botone so we can go back to it if we want, but I'll go ahead and press play for the next speaker. We'll see who it is. Okay, can you hear that okay? Mm -hmm. Ain't 
Johnny Anko, I don't know, from the Anko family. You didn't ask me, but I thought it was so funny because she said he was telling the story. It's about raising your children. And naturally, as parents, we all want that, you know, and we were so proud when we're raising good people. And <laughs> she said they tried their best and their boy went out one time and he didn't come in. And he got he got home after daylight. And he was going to advise him and chastise him, I guess. And his wife said, no, let him eat first. And then you can do it after he eats. And he <laughs> said, I really got started. He got a hop on the kudede and keep on the moge autom. He said he, he got upset and he jumped up to go to, I guess, to go on the bed. It was just funny the way he told it. He said, I was just trying to cry. <laughs> and he said, that's so typical of young men. It, you don't hardly have that with your daughters. It's, it's funny. And it just start, struck me just the way she told it. But having the respect and stay home. Omoy ka on this means you're ka on because you're kind to people. And we always talk about how many ways you can be caught on. And that's the best way to be caught on, oh my. Be kind to your neighbors, be kind to anybody. And there's uh, some words in there that were interesting. They said, when we get old, we like to go to. And really, we forgot. Omoy ka on, and then she said the values are, she taught them not to eat at any home or spend the night. You may stay home. 
and just uh, just typical. But they did raise good children. Mannerly. As long as they got good manners. Oh, I'm fin I'm finished on my go and different words that I pulled out of there. Oh, which uh oh. who was that? Which speaker was that? Was it Hazel? No, I don't think that was I think it was Isabel. 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 Somebody that's uh, useful as an adult. Mokuime. <clears throat> oh, uh, oh, Grandma. Um, Miss Marion, do you want to comment next? She's talking about respect, and she said we were told by our Grandma and Grandpa and our mother said to to learn in working. You know, they were so old. And, to think about these things and the girls should be helping. We're told the girls should be helping their mother and grandma and grandpa is, is told them, giving them advice. And you um, don't just sit around and do nothing, but get up and learn. And you learn by watching. And then uh, they, the mother and grandma will show the girls how to do things. and girls just stay home and the grandpa told them girls stay home don't be roaming around and learn from your mother and grandma he said go out and play but don't don't go spending at night someplace else because you learn bad things when you are around others and uh, especially those I guess that are not good reputation and there's lots of uh, advice to gain, and she says, can you learn from the books and work and get a good job, and then also do God's work, his religion, God keeps God people. So, and those three things are all related. And so, um, just um, from all these things, you will learn, you will gain things in your life. And just uh, the same thing, she said, I teach my children, our children, we should tell our children to take this advice. And um, because as we grow, we learn. And she said, we're thinking about good things for the family, for the children. And learning from books is also good. And then she talks about John and <laughs> We didn't come home. And uh, until... He wants to spend the night someplace else. And so that Dorothy fill that in. And I guess Martha will have comments. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you That's guys, you, you and Dorothy did real well. Y'all yeah, told the whole story. But there was a few little things that were jotted down. It's when uh, that lady's talking, she was talking she said, a long time ago. You know, and she said, um, uh, hmm. on a good to hop. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> People are always given words of wisdom, in other words, is what she's saying. And then she talked about the grandparents, you know, helping to uh, tell these young people what they needed to do. And, and it was all about learning, you know, watch your um, uh, mom when she's working, and that's how the girls will learn. And she said something about one of them was always, this lady was always beating. She said and it was something good that the girls could learn. Uh, and back in those days, I'm sure that's the way it was. Uh, and let's see. Um, was the grandpa was the one was talking to that boy, and he said, "Don't be staying in somebody else's house." <laughs> he's kind of like he said, "You'll get crazy if you go. <laughs> You'll do crazy things or something." And so that was his uh, little warning there, or words of wisdom. And then kept talking about work and how you could do better. And he said, there's a lot of different types of work. And one of them was like church work, you know, that kind of stuff. And then he <laughs> mentioned something about three things together. And I wasn't quite sure what that was. I might have missed something. Uh, but he said. That was the books and God. Yeah. But he was saying, ma, ma good. 
may all may or something like that. You know, you could become wise too if you learned right, <laughs> if you did the right thing. Uh, he said, never forget her, your spiritual teaching. He was compressing kind of that on him. Uh, and then to have a good life. Uh, they want good things for the family. Uh, there's a lot of good learning ways. And then I guess, of course, we got to that man, that uncle man, Johnny Uncle. And he um, was mad at that boy for staying out. <laughs> and he was going to light into him real quick. And the lady said, no, let him finish eating at least, you know, before he did that. And then uh, when he started talking to the boy, started crying. And uh, what he said was, he said, good don't get, get cope. That means wise words will, are, are, they could be hurtful, you know, because uh, young kids don't want to hear that after they know they did wrong anyway in the first place, getting chewed out. So I like that, good don't get, get cope. Um, and that's kind of how I ended that. Oh, oh, awesome. This seems like a really, th this would be a really good one to translate, seems like. You know, uh, yeah, something, that was... I, something I noticed, it's uh, Marty and Marion, it's you, and then Courtney and Alice, and any other person that we have in the class. And I know, you know, you come from, all of you come from that true Kiowa environment of how they're describing your race to be, I always say, good girls. And I can tell just just uh, sitting back with my old body, I can tell just, just little things or and a lot of you, well, all of you, I knew your grandparents and everybody, and I know, and that's supposed to be a compliment. Most of you were Kiowa princes. And it, that's the uh, thing with Grandma, I used to say. Yeah. Those Kiowa words, they hurt, they hurt. Yeah. They can hurt more than the English words because you know them. It's, you know, <laughs> Me too. It's really, say, really, I got to eat with because my grandma. Can give, give, she, she I remember my as, mother as the English. braiding my hair so hard that my eyes would be pulled back. <laughs> and she'd say, you're going over to these people's house. Don't you eat over there. She's uh, raising grandkids. You know, you come home and eat. I'd be the first one dipping my biscuit. <laughs> and he's sitting there because I was our kind. You know, they'll say, sit down and eat. <laughs> Got it. <really. laughs> Always catch a dick. I was the only young one. <laughs> Well, if you ever got in trouble, you sure didn't want to hear that lecture that came with it, you know. I know it. Ooh, that's, God. That's right. You didn't want that. Grandma would think the gypsies kidnapped us from the fair. We didn't come <laughs> in and check. <laughs> they don't want us. <laughs> they used to have a convoy of gypsies that came. Did y'all know that we're going to have a holiday in uh, August? The Apaches went to the city council meeting and they got the grandstand and stuff, the whole fairgrounds for the first week in August. Oh, wow. So whatever we have, it better be good. I'm, I'm anxious. The thing is, I, I'm... I am sure I from I don't want but that that property there, that land, I think it's KCA land or just Kiowa land over there at the fairgrounds. I think they keep that was out there let's see. On. for some they event. A little while ago. And it looked okay. So maybe but this was Monday at the city council meeting. That the Apache tribe got the hmm. for an event for five days. 
So maybe we'll have a, a parade and stuff. That's such a important thing that we better not lose track of. I rather call oh. work late in my imminent domain. Imminent domain. Mm. Being a time apprentice for is an institution. It it's something that goes with the fair. From the time we that's first why it was that's why it was yeah. when it first started. But the princess. Who can forget the horseshoe or the big camps? And all of that. It was my joy of the year. May camps everywhere in the horseshoe, south side, north side, everywhere. There's a best, best week. They're all the, but the main subject from our elders, it seems to be advice. Mm -hmm. And that's really true when you get older, you, you think, it, it, well, you know, because you've lived it. I don't care. That's a, <laughs> when you get older, you think you know it all. And, you know, so came in here for the basketball game and I said, when are they going to kick off? <laughs> <laughs> Every TV in the house going, that was a disappointment. Uncle Melody, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Um, okay, do we want to listen to the next speaker or do we want to go back and try to translate uh, Isabel to Hatchet's speech? What do y'all want to do? What are you saying we're going to do? Uh, translate it? This what you're saying? Yeah, if we want to, mm. it's uh, you know, up to up to the group, whatever people would like, whatever y'all prefer. Well, it doesn't look that hard to do because <laughs> you can <laughs> hear you can hear her speaking. That's why you can, yeah, you can anything's ask. okay with me. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. So let's um. Let me rewind it and let's see if we can uh, start translating Isabel to Hatchet. Sounds like she has some good, good stories in there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let me go back. Let me share my screen and I'll go back to uh, 14 minutes. And uh, let's see, 14 minutes. Okay. All right. And I will try to, we'll have to do a lot of rewinding. So, <laughs> okay. Uh, cool. No, yeah, don't want to. That was her first. What? What? Yeah. What kind of song? What would that be? Okay. Right, that's what she said at first. Mm -hmm. okay. um.
Monim Dorta, I think it's got composer. I said maybe they're singing. Monim Dorta. Okay, let me write this down. <clears throat> Does she say Ehande Ki Dot Ba Anga Dozanma? Get Get Anga Get Dozanma. Uh, Isabel two hatchet. So, uh, can you repeat one of you repeat what she said with that first line? Aha de ki dot ba get anga or anga get the lama. What did she say? Get get the lama like we're talking. Okay. Ain't go. Get those on or eight those on. Get those on. Yeah, get. Ain't what a key dot ba. She said, Ain't what a key dot ba. Get those on ma. That means now we're talking. On this day. Mm -hmm, right now. Mm -hmm. Today. I said today. Okay, on this day, today we are talking. We are talking. Okay. All right, let me play that again and then we'll keep yeah. we'll play it to the next race. <laughs> U on key. Way long Way. time ago. U on key. Is that what she said? Yeah. Long time ago. Yeah. U on key. That means it was long time ago. Yeah. On key. On key. That means a pass when you say on key. The pass. Yeah. The pass. On key, get dormy. Long time ago, because she said, Ooh, long time. Ooh. Oh, okay, let me rewind it. Yeah, <laughs> Son, when you when you 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 Sorry, I have to play it again. I have to try to write down. Yeah, they <laughs> She's got that anger on there. Anger is right after that day when she says today. Anger the key dot ba. 
ang on and she says something in there and i think that's where that uh, pronoun is maybe different i don't know oh okay you hear it again one more time okay let me let me rewind it Did you hear it? Yeah. In that case, she says angle Barely. get those on Angle get those on my. So I changed that from get to get. Yeah. Because she that angle, I didn't hear it the first time. So now she's saying it. Okay. Anga, anga, yeah. Those on. Yeah. Because it's angle means you know, like right here and now we're talking. Yeah, right here. Mm -hmm. Right oh, here. We're talking. They're talking. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and then she says, okay, so let me let me play it for the when she says long ago. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, That's Kohai go. Kohai. Oh, Couldn't get it right. Yeah, ko hai hai ga or hai ya. A long time ago. I would say honya ko hai hai ga. Honya ko hai ga. I don't exactly know, and it is what she's saying. Yeah. Exactly no. Yeah. Didn't have it precisely on point, you know. Didn't have it, but. I don't think nobody does even now. Oh, okay. Let's hear it one more time. See if we can catch it. Yeah, they keep that bank with your two son. Oh, on key hun more, yeah, your ma. What did she say right before that? Akoi. Something I can't hear. Usually okay. I hear I hear you talking real plain, Melody. Okay, let me uh let me try to switch the speakers. Sometimes my computer switches the speakers on me. Let me see. Okay, now I'm going to rewind it and tell me if you can hear it any better. Yeah, they keep that bank with your two son, ma. Oh, on the hon more, yeah, your ma. Come high, go, go. And get all quiet, don't high, go, go, and you could have failed the more. And then she stops. They didn't know how to talk English. Or what she's calling it is talk. Or they didn't know how to talk white. It's not talk either. How would you say that? It's not really English, don't get, of course, don't get. Uh, okay, let me rewind it one more time. Don't sign my, I think I got that out of there. Okay. Yeah, they key that bank with your two son, ma. Oh, on key, hon, more, yeah, your ma. Come high, go, go. 
What you guys think? I think she's going to say Peltamogo. Mm. Get smart thinking. Smart. Okay. go go no go no get built go right that's the way I heard it Okay. Oh, oh okay. Let me play it one more time. Yeah, the key that bank would you have your two son ma ooh on key hon mo yeah ye ma come high go go and get all quite tung high go go and you could you pail the mo go on the yeah pail the ton ma go I get there a key dog. Now, how would you say you felt them all go? Smart thinking? Mm hmm. Felt them all go. Felt them all go. Good thinking. It's what it means. Is that what it means? Mm hmm. Longer felt. So good humility. Oh, yeah. They're speaking the Queen's Kiowa. <laughs> like that. <laughs> okay, let me play it one more time. Hey, key that bank with you, your two son, ma. Ooh, on key, hon, ma, yeah, your ma. Come high, go, go. Get all quite tongue high, go, go, and you could get pale the mock on the yapail the ton. Yapail the ton. Honda. Yapail though. What'd you say? Yapail though. Ton. Mogo. No, they, they know how to think and figure, I guess is what she means. They know how to figure or decipher or they were smart. <laughs> Said how you guys heard it. Yeah, build the mongo and then get build the tongue. Yeah, fatal though. Oh, oh. You found it. You mm -hmm. learned it. Okay. You found it. Get your brain learned. Oh. Ooh, on key hon mo yeah, ye ma come high go go and get all quite tung high go go and you could ye pail the mo go hon de ye pail the ton mo go I get there a key a dog they grew up I got the that in between didn't you decipher that already mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, um, so we have a hundred key that fa and get dozama. Oh, a key hon maga hunger ma kohai go go. No get kohai go. Akoi no hai go. No 
kya pero to ma ga han de kya kya pero to ta ma ga ha to ha got it she speaks like really clearly it's it's easy to i like i like hearing her speak <laughs> Okay, let me uh, let's see what she says next here. After the when she says, "Ah, get they." Yeah, get ma, come high, go go. You get okay, don't high, go go. You go get pay the ma, go on the. Get pay the ton ma go. Ah, get there, at the yard, okay go. Ah, the did she say anki agya de anki or anki ah anki ah da agya de anki ah anki ah yeah e like in wood or a husband e you got the spit like your groom e e they grew up good. Yeah, like remember that uh Oh, oh okay. Yeah, okay. where'd you grow up? Yeah. Yeah. Uh okay. like, yeah, like wood or like your husband. Ike. <laughs> or you going to pick up wood? Are you going up to wood? Are you going after wood? <laughs> <laughs> it's easy for that, you know, to miss uh, miss that if a word means three different things. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Uh, so they grew up good. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to rewind like a couple seconds and then see what she says after that. I don't have to go. You could have failed the mom. That's what we want. Mm -hmm. What was that? Solho da on da. Wouldn't that be saying that's how we want it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Like, da da on da. And then what do you say that means? Yeah. Solha da on da. Da is all of them. You know, if, it, if that's the way we want it. Oh. So da da. Or if like you, that's that's what we hope for. You know, that's basically what she's saying. Yeah. What we're hoping. Right. What y'all are doing right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the the free translation would be that's what we hope for. Yeah, that's kind of what she's getting to. Yeah. If it was just her that wanted it, she'd say, solo, yeah, on, I see. How would you say it? Uh, yeah, on, though. Yeah, on, though, yeah. what she'd say herself. Do, yeah. on, though, it's all of them. Mm -hmm. Oh, Us. okay. We, yeah. We, we, okay, we hope, let's see. We want that or we hope for that or something. Oh. Uh, cool. I go go get a coy tongue high go go and you could get pale the mock on the get pale the tongue mock on the get there at the yard dog you go you could solo the on dog got to go a good dog can the good either solo dog on the good dog means advice <laughs> Advice. Okay, let's see. 
I think it's a what does she say after on da da on da? That's what we want. Mm -hmm. And then she said tol ha, tol ha. That's the way or something. Tol ha. With the tol ha, it's that's the way. Make sure you make the L sound out on it. Tol ha. It is not Toha, it's Tolha. Yeah, T S O L. T S O L. Yeah. Ha. Yeah. No D. No D. He got Toha. Da. Da on da. Mm -hmm. Then oh, oh. she's saying something before she says the good thong. Let's see. That's what we want, and we'd like, like to give advice. Does she say like ba de ga or ga? So hard on the I go to help. And through there she says, Yapega. How does she say it, yo? Yapega mega manga. They leave, they use their thoughts. They're real good at that. Maga. Maga. Yeah, build build the maga. Build the maga is to be able to think things out and figure it out. So I think that's what it is. Use your brain. Yeah, they can figure things out. <laughs> oh, build the maga. She mm -hmm. says they're sharp minds. Yeah, and they get it done real fast, and mm -hmm. that's just what we want. And like a quick thinking mind, you know, pick it up. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, okay. The witty one. Build the mark on your build the ton of gold. I get there at ya, doggy go. It got so low, the on dog got go. You sit, they, they think fast. I got the Akiado, and we just said that about you, you guys that are here today. I got the Akiado. Oh, and then she says, uh, Giga. Well Giga raised. Is what I well mm -hmm. raised. Okay. Mm -hmm. Giga, Hega, Solha. Da on da. Go de good on da. Hold on, let me play that again. Is it good to hop or does she hop? Oh, yeah, good to hop. Let's see. I get there at ya, doggy go. I got so low da on da, got go a good to hop. Can the good to hop. Okay, she says a good. Don't hop first. Uh, I have to give advice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me put that up here. Okay, so she's. What is she saying? She says, "God, de God, agu don't hop." What's that mean? Is that like a filler? Where am I getting this to? I got something where she says, caught Hago, something in there like that. Yeah, okay. Hop or before? I don't know if it's before hop or after. Yeah, okay. Let me let me play it. Uh, let's see, rewind it a little bit. Okay. 
Okay, that card hey guys at the beginning of that um they're well raised and that's what we want and that's why we like to give advice. So she says ga is it day ga? Or ga hey ga. Aguto ha. She's saying something in between, like right before aguto ha. That's where she said caught hey ga. You know that caught hey ga aguto ha. Oh, so how would you spell it? Um, I'd put a hard K sound in that A U T hey ga a t g a u. And Kaiwas, our elders use the word taigate, tiado. Huh. And then they, they used to translate it and say, good teachings. What time? What time? Okay, you said it was a uh, Yeah, And I think can you break it. can you break that down like the word the break, word by word literal? Literal, let's see. Yeah. Um, um, that God is kind of like and they they or then. And it's kind of put another and they are them. and then uh, they are um um they like to give advice. Yeah. Like to give advice. <laughs> That's what it comes down to. They're all about uh -huh. advice. That's just their way. And then uh okay, so that's right. That's what she's saying. And then she says, does she say ga gu to ta? She says uh, something after the gu to ta or before. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, that's you know, oh, three, oh. three um, or whatever. A whole bunch of people. <laughs> so she's uh, saying we mm, give advice. Mm, we like, we give we, advice. Uh, we like to give advice because that hop means you're prone to do that. Anything with a okay. hop, okay, prone to do that. We like to give advice. <clears throat> awesome. Okay, so let's see if I got it here. I get there. I go. She said, hey go, or nego, hey go. Those are just spacers. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. Aww. So she said, after the gu don ta, she did she say conte like talking about grandparent? Yeah, conte. I'm so long. Okay, let me rewind it. As hear Grandpa talking. What was that, Grandma Dorothy? Conte Hanantompora. Grandpa, we could hear him talking. Okay, Paul. All right, I'm trying to type it out while you're talking. Okay. 
Okay. Can someone repeat what she said? Conte. Conte. Conte, Grandpa. Mm -hmm. we could, well, you might say we could hear him talking. Is it Conte? Yeah. You can hear them speaking. Thanks. Like, and grandpa, that's the way he was talking. Yeah. Grandpa, that's the way he was talking. You're hearing the voice, his voice come out when he's speaking. Oh. Okay, let me rewind it one more time. He gets to my mother. Mm -hmm. It says grandma in there too, doesn't it say? Tante. 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 Yeah. yeah. It's grandpa. It's grandpa and then it's grandma and mother. Uh, it's uh, Tante. That's, that's mama. I know, but before that, he says Tante. 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 He goes, hey, God. Hey, God. Tante. 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 And then he goes on and says, Tante. 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 What? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, let me see. Okay. She said, on don't get on. Okay. Oh, went too far. Let me go back a little bit. Okay, let's see. All right, let me, um, I'm going to rewind it and start from the beginning so we, and I can show my screen because we're almost at time. Oh, sorry, Alison, I just saw your questions in the chat. Um, so this is uh, Kiowa Proverbs number 241 from the Kiowa Culture Program. And 
This is Isabel Tuhatchet, the fourth speaker on that recording. Okay, I'm gonna share my screen again. Who said that? Oh, um, Alice, Alice Ann, she had a question. Oh. That was me. I was trying to figure out who, what recording it was so I can go back and re-listen. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Let me go to, let's see, 1440 is when she starts. Okay. Uh, so you should be able to see my screen. Can you see the words on this uh, other side here? Yeah. It's Johnny Anko. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. All right, I'll go. I don't want to go. Yeah, they keep that bank with you. Your two son, ma. Oh, on the hon ma, yeah, your ma. Come high, go, go. You get all quiet, don't high, go, go. You could get bail to ma, go, hon. ยะเปิลตะทานมากอตาเกตะอะจีอาตะกิโกเกตะซลอตะออนตะกะติโกอะกูตะฮะกันตะกูตะตะคงเตะกอซลานันตะปอตะกอตะทาเตงกอออนก
Pupa on the teon go. They take ears a on target or tempa on the opa good and He said, agony on them, no, you know, that was used quite a bit in old Iowa. You know, I was about to cry or I was about to shed tears. They go, me, they all tired, you know, and stuff. That's funny. And he said he was about to cry and he's putting that in his talk. And his grandson jumped up and left the table. He's talking about not liking to take advice. That's it. Did y'all understand that all the way through, Marty? Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, that's, uh, yeah, that should be easy to translate, uh, Melody. Not easy, yeah. but I mean, there's not any, uh, yeah. I heard every word. Where are you going? Yeah. Awesome. To where? Very clear talker. Uh, Wait till I get up. This is all going about going about hold on, but hold on. He said, "Don't don't take up space." He said, "Well, going about hold on, stop." Oh yeah, hold on, me. Oh, that, that's cute, but that's typical Kyle. I I doubt if I could tell a story that long with uh, not a break. Mm -hmm. In Kiowa, I mean, <laughs> I hadn't heard that in a long time. No, but tell me, go on over there, taking up space. Kiowa, Kiowa <laughs> language has a yeah. sense of humor. Just by you word, you, you say the words, and then the wonder of it is there's no vulgarity in it at all. Oh. You don't have to have, uh, uh, you know, talk. It's just a gentleman's language, I think. Yeah. Even that is good about mm -hmm. Kairos. It's a yeah, rep yeah, try. clean yeah, language. Reprimand by grandma, grandpa. You just sure, they sure use some good, strong words. <laughs> Describe it. Stop dog. <laughs> or... <laughs> It's calling an oh, owl. It doesn't hurt. And then, uh, what about Conende? What does that mean? No, Conende. Those are cute, but Conende. everyone You're kind of going there. overboard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's like even respect. My goodness. You younger ones, there's even a way to reject somebody when they want to date or something, and you don't like them. Hola, Kai, go say not pine, go be tame, day. And just like you don't have a chance, stretch your neck, tie your snot, and start running. 
was so cute <laughs> that day. <laughs> Stretch your neck. Oh, like I like you can. <laughs> and then Lance told me they or they say go be on go kick yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Even our rejections like that are are funny. That's awesome. <laughs> um, well, we're at five o'clock. Um, so well, uh, we'll have to pick up this uh, recording next time. Um, but we made some progress, so that was fun. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get to uh, finish uh, translating uh, Isabel to Hatchet soon. So, ah, who did about, huh? Um, let's see. Um, Hande and Saito. Hande. Um, well, I thought for our elders, I was um, wanting to get a couple translations for, um, I keep forgetting to do this for, to double check for Nora's um, language fair poster. Um, so for to say I love my family, uh, uh, date day hop, hosoho, or that would be the most appropriate way to say that. What are, what did you say, honey? Uh, uh, hot so on a thong. Yeah, I love my family. Let's see. Why would you say it? No. I see. How would you say family, you guys? Stay no. Stay cool. So we just got to no. use it. No. Family. 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 Stay cool. No. Stay cool. Or you, if you want to individualize it, if it's, uh, you know, your own family. No, eager. No. Uh, no. No. Eager, that means you yeah. and your children. Yeah. Eager, go. No, e. That's putting it to your immediate family, your children and your husband. Go, they they do, or you'd say eager, go no e. They own fatal do. Whichever way, you know, to. There's two different ways I've seen it written, but by love, we, uh, my section always say, go the aim do. Mm -hmm. I hold you close to my heart. And uh, I thought that because aim on fatal do translated, translate to, I like you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So she's saying, uh, how do you say for the elders, go te, hey, go, go te, aim, no, but if you're saying, are you including everybody, all your relatives, or are you just, are you trying to say, I love the elders, or? Uh, her uh, immediate is, family, is, her children and her husband, it's what I think. Um, uh, she says she's for a poster, poster, what is she trying to say? You know, there's a. There's a saying, there's a, a Kiowa church song, and it says, Aho dog, e, 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 te, kida, ink, agya, e, e, kida, ink, agya. My children and I have a good day. Yeah. And you say, Beta dog, he ain't failed all day. The Lord was thinking about me. No, he got Kida and Taga. But that he got is your, all of your children or your family. It just, to me, that's what it is. 
Uh, yeah, here's Courtney, her what's the title of your poster? What's the title that you're looking you for? It? Let me see if I can fix this video. I'm trying to fix the video. I don't know what's going on with it. You can't see it too well. It, she, okay. she drew it. She, Nora drew it. She wants it to say, I love my family. Oh, I, I guess what Marty, Marty yeah. said would be more appropriate. Take goop. They go they bodo or bo or they do. I say go they they do. You're telling someone that you love all of them. Yeah. They do. They do. You just keep it simple. Mm -hmm. Okay, like, here we go. <laughs> I haven't oh, she she cute. Said she, said. <laughs> she said she wants it to say I love my family. Go they they do. Okay. Mm -hmm. So ho. Go they do. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Does anybody have they got ribbon shirt skirts on? <laughs> That's so cute. I love that. I love it just to have one. Uh, I said she made me a new dress. Look. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> She's kind of our designer. She can uh I'll give her stuff and uh she'll like if I'm doing designs or something for beadwork, she'll she'll color them in and kind of make it pretty. <laughs> That's good. I always so. sit behind people like at if any place at a <laughs> at a ceremonial or a dance or something, and I'll say, "Don't mind me. I've been copying your belt <laughs> all day." <laughs> people used to get tickled. I can't bead. <laughs> love to look at beadwork. Okay. I've gotten too old to even hold the needle. <sighs> but the, it's funny how that needle will go in that same where you stuck yourself in it. Uh-huh. It always finds a way to see. <laughs> what she told you, Mar Marty, how did she say it? It's it sounds good to me. Okay. They go go they they do. It just sounds like I love my family. Yes. Love my family. Go. Go. Day. Go. Day. Day, though. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's yeah, and she's going to use the terms or her, uh, she's going to put my, my dad, my mom, and Jude. So, okay. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh -oh. She, she would have come in and asked, but it's so pretty. I sent her outside to play. <laughs> it's so nice out there. Oh, it is. Good day. Uh -huh. Awesome. All right. Um, well, to uh, close this up, uh, let's see. Um, uh, Grandma Martha Nell, if you're mm -hmm. able to uh, bait outside. Okay. Stop on my daughter. Oh, they get on though. And what key? Key to get though. They ain't ho. Get those on long. Get the good ho. Go it don't get. Get more time go. Go get more hand. Um, they go mean get peak getting. Uh, Hi all on um, get those on my uh, oh yeah um thought they go get hide it oh uh, huh? do you have any father we give you thanks for everything especially today today was a beautiful day we are still working with our Kiowa language we're still teaching and learning and we're hoping that the uh, younger people coming be behind us will pick it up and be able to take it forward and share it yes. and teach it. And also wanted to say thank you for everyone who was able to attend this meeting today and kind of give their perspective. Uh, please keep them. Um, and we give thanks for everything that you do give us every day. Um, Bless everyone here.
Yeah. Uh, I'm going to share something with you, Melody, before you cut us off. Okay. Uh, yesterday, we were all at the dance at Carnegie, and uh, we got there late, and uh, and my husband was the last minute add-on because he was coming from the wildlife res reserve, and I asked uh -huh. him to meet me so he could go with me, and I could stay a little longer. If not, I'd have to leave early to get back to Norman, <laughs> so he agreed to. So I picked him up at the Y. He left his truck there. So we get down there and we get settled. And when it came to the supper hour, uh, just prior to that, the tribal princess, Kyla, came by and she was giving little goodie bags out, you know, little candy and stuff in there. And mm -hmm. um, when she came by, he doesn't eat much now in his old age. He just eats very little because he's lost his taste and smell of food. But uh, mm -hmm. he just eats enough to get by. And uh, so he told her, he said, no, no, thank you. And then she was kind of taken aback a little bit, but uh, she handed Carrie and I a bag of peace and Carrie was saying, tell him to take it and give it to me. <laughs> and, <laughs> and so he did, he took it and he thanked her, <laughs> he thanked her for it. And then um, later on, it was dinner time and Melody's two youngest daughters came over there <laughs> and they were dressed real nice. And I think it was Merlina, she said, she came up to Carrie and I, and she said, may I get you to the plate, you know, plate of food? And I said, oh, that would be so sweet, you know? So they left and they came back with our food. And uh, uh, I think they asked Robert and he said, no, you know, that's okay. He said, he said that's okay, I don't need anything. And uh, so when they left, I told him, I said, Robert, you can't do that. Uh, and um, Dorothy knows this, his, <laughs> father, his father is Kiowa, but his mother was Delaware. And they got raised by that mother. So they, their ways are kind of like that. And uh, I told him, I said, you can't do that with Kari was, you know, if someone offers you something, I said, I don't care what it is. I said, you take a sample of it and maybe you ate too much, drank too much already, but you do that. I said, because it's kind of bad manners to turn it down. So knowing that, <laughs> the funniest thing was I saw Nora coming across the dance floor and she's bringing a real nice plate and she kept looking at Robert <laughs> she kept looking at Gorky and uh he, he knew it he knew that by the time I'd given him talking to too she got real close she didn't say anything but she kept kind of looking at him and I said hi Nora I said is that plate for Gorky and she shook her head yes you know and he took it he took it and the thing was Carrie and I had a little bowl of meat and um uh, fried bread and some side dish on our dish when he got his he had a lot of good stuff on it he had fruit and uh probably pudding and he had a big piece of fried chicken on it. and my friend carrie loves fried chicken and she's looking over there and she knows he doesn't eat that one. so she said oh my gosh look at that chicken she said, I'll <laughs> tell him to give me that chicken so it was funny because we, we thanked nora and she went back and i thought that was real sweet that those girls knew to do that but at the same oh. time, I had to teach my husband a lesson about Kiowa etiquette. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I don't oh. think he'll do that again. <laughs> Next time, he'll have three plates stacked up. <laughs> <laughs> Big plates. <laughs> oh. That was cute, cute. I was glad those girls did that. <laughs> oh, shoot. Good. So hungry for... Um. You made me hungry for meat. <laughs> it was good. It was very good. <laughs> meat. Yeah, and the, meat. Uh, the meat was uh, was uh, my aunt Gloria, and uh, she had her girl, her granddaughters help her, Vivian and Georgia, and oh. so they helped cook that meat. And I was like, they did a good job. And they, you know, they all cooked the meat for our camp too during Gore Clan. I'm like, man, they're getting good. <laughs> <laughs> they make the chicken and dumplings too. Uh, you know what? I don't know who made that. I didn't ask. Those dumplings were great. Huh? <laughs> I know Nevea had two bowls. <laughs> she went and got more. <laughs> that's that's Jude's favorite is chicken and dumplings. And we said we're gonna leave as soon as they break for supper. We had to go to a baby shower, and then next thing you know. 
I was, um, we, I told him, I said, well, we'll help serve supper and then we'll go. And I know we'll eat over there. So it's okay if you don't get through the line. And then next thing you know, they're in the line. And <laughs> then Courtney told me after when we were on our way, he said, well, we were, we were going to just get undressed and start making our way unload or loading up. And then Jude saw chicken and dumplings and he had to jump in line. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good meal. <laughs> it was. <laughs> it was yummy. They yeah. had some good desserts too. They had lots of choices. <laughs> Grandma Dorothy, I posted some videos for you on my Facebook. So you'll be able to see some videos of it's just a little, just short videos, but of uh, board dancing and then uh, the War Mother songs. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> it was fun. But yeah, April 1st is their next benefit. So April 1st in Carnegie. Ooh, okay. April 1st. That's what they announced at the end of the night. So, no April yeah. Fools. Well, they said it's April Fools, but they said everyone be there. And <laughs> they, they made uh they made sixteen hundred and ninety-three dollars. They counted it up. Ooh. So they did pretty good. That's pretty good. That's a lot of money. Yeah. And, and I mean, there was a good amount of people, but people, you know, after supper break, people started kind of leaving. And so, but they still raised a good, a good amount. That was fun. Damn. But good. yeah, it was good to see everyone. It's good to dance. Um, the War Mother's benefit. I ate everything, I almost ate my plate up. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Oh, I got I got sad because I guess Aunt Buki she didn't have anyone to take her. I guess because uh, my aunt Karen went down to Lawton, and so Aunt Buki was there. And by the time I I got there and I looked and I was like, oh man, Auntie. But you know she likes getting there when they set up, you know, so she can get her spot. And she was like, next time, next time. I said, all right, I'm gonna pick you up. <laughs> Oh, so, yeah, but it was fun. Vision got to sing, so that's all he wanted. He just wanted to sing. <laughs> all right, well, I'll let everyone go. I got to go uh, start dinner here for these guys. Okay. Yeah. So, hey, <laughs> oh, oh. Stay safe and healthy. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, oh. Oh, yeah, the Batoyan Bye. 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 Ribs and then uh, having uh, that, what do you call it? Roof, what you call it? <laughs> uh, Jumbo <laughs> Cooper said that one time. What do you call that, Marty? Shingles. Oh, ah. I was uh, that, and then I broke four ribs, and then I caught COVID. Gosh. You broke four ribs? Yes. Ah. Oh. I just wow. don't last night we missed seeing you so i was worried for you oh i'm glad uh, you're feeling better grandma i am really i really feel good now so good it's just yeah good to think of roof, roof repair if you can't think yeah. of shingles oh i would <laughs> wish that on nobody oh. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Jumbo Cooper that time, he said, sister, I'm really sick. I said, what's the matter? He said, I got that, you know, roof. <laughs> the roof. The roof. <laughs> he said, the roof. I never even knew it existed. Oh, man. Blessings well, to you. See you all Wednesday. Ah, oh, yep. We're going to do our immersion session on Wednesday, so get ready <laughs> okay this one looks like it's a clear trail now you know it's uh and understanding her all the way 
Oh, yeah, it'll be it'll be fun. This is a good one. We made good progress. Yeah. And if you do that, you might make it, you know, just reading it because you uh, kept up with it so good. <laughs> well, it's because she speaks so clearly. It's it's a lot easier to hear her than than James Silverhorn. <laughs> yeah, she does. I like her. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Well, have fun. Good luck. Yeah. Stay safe. <laughs> y'all pray for grandma. I'll see y'all. Oh. Oh.